We do that by developing American-made sources of energy. Congressman Steve Booyer brings his message from Capitol Hill to Greater Lafayette. Good evening, I'm Jeff Smith. And I'm Nicole Kahn. Nice to have you here with us tonight. Congressman Steve Booyer says the economy, energy policy, and health care reform are key topics he is concerned about. The District 4 congressman met with reporters in Lafayette today to discuss these issues, and Renetta Dubos was there. She joins us now. Renetta, what is Congressman Booyer's biggest concern? Well, his biggest concern is federal spending. He says he wants the federal government to take a step backward on its spending habits before it's too late. It is now estimated that if we continue at this level of federal spending, the national debt uh, in, this, uh, in 10 years could reach $23 trillion. Congressman Steve Booyer says federal spending is at its highest now, creating a trillion-dollar national debt. He says the Obama administration, which blames former President George W. Bush, is also at fault because of inappropriate action taken thus far. The restraints on the growth of our um, budget right now are not in place. Um, a lot of the appropriations bills that are coming up, uh, you've, you've got an increases you know, anywhere from 6 to 8 percent annual increases in their budget. When it comes to energy, Booyer says the Democratic administration's plan to reduce carbon emissions, known as cap and trade, is an unfair practice. He cites two areas of the nation where utility companies now receive carbon emission credits. The federal government is, is giving money to utilities in the Pacific Northwest and California, for example, and the Northeast whereby their energy portfolios have, have a very small carbon footprint. The 4th District Congressman is also concerned about the health care reform. He supports the Associated Health Care Plan, which he says would reduce premiums for small businesses by allowing them to pool their risk. Democrats propose what's called a single-payer system, which the Congressman says is government-run. You're squeezing the, pri the private pay system. And as you squeeze the private pay system, you're squeezing them into the public option. On the agenda this week, Congressman Booyer says a foreign appropriations bill will be introduced. He says he will offer an amendment to that bill to restrain the growth to the 2009 level of federal spending. Renetta Dubose, News Channel 18.